first thing is to understand the skill set that you've got within your practice today. Have you currently got the right people with the skills who can offer advisory services to your clients? If not, then that is a choice between upskilling your existing colleagues, your existing employees, or at every opportunity where you're looking to grow your practice with new skills, with new people, then to understand if there's an opportunity to bring in people with those advisory skills from the market. Next, uh, look at your customers. Understand your customers. We talk about the importance about getting closer to your clients. They will already be asking you questions today which will give you insight into the kind of pain points that they're trying to address as organizations. It's really important to profile your entire customer base to understand what services that you can offer to them. So if you're getting asked questions such as, how do similar industries, how do similar businesses in my region perform? Or how do they undertake certain things? Then that's, that's a warning sign, that's a signal for you that they are looking for benchmarking services, for example. 